Well, it's another beautiful, beautiful morning out here. And again, we are at the park, but that's okay because we're supposed to have a special guest with us today. They'll show up here in a minute, probably on their way. Big day today. Uh, one of the biggest things is my daughter's getting married. So we're gonna come down and hunt real quick, try to clear the mind. You ever wonder what dads do before their daughters get married? Well, this dad right here is at the park doing a little hunting. And while I was waiting on my hunting buddy to get here or my special guest or whatever, I went over and done a little test hit on the area. I hadn't hunted that much. Just walking through, ended up pulling a weedy real quick. So hopefully we have run into a pretty good little area. We're gonna find out here in just a minute, wait on him to get here and then we'll see what happens so hey sit back enjoy like i said hopefully we'll pull something good out of the ground here at the park again which keeps giving so let's see what we can do take a look at the weed you can barely see it it's the green i'll try to get a date off of it see what's going on so hey i'll get back to you here in a minute let's see if they'll show up if they do we'll do a little intro with them and we'll get to hunting for about an hour or two and then off to Give my daughter away. So hang loose. Here we go. Well, like I said, down here at the park. I don't know if you can see him way over. The park rat pad has showed up down here in the park. So we're down here digging the park that just keeps giving. I'm not saying we're going to find anything or not, but I felt something very interesting. I don't know really what it is because it's rusted up. See if we can zoom in here a little bit. And they gonna let me hear yeah, there is maybe okay. There is a piece down here that is around a root. A root is grown through whatever this is. Looks like an old chain link or something. But it is pretty interesting. So I'm gonna try to get it out of here. That hurting too much stuff up. Put the plug back. I thought that was kind of interesting. That root grew right through that. So, hey, till we find something better, or I get over and get to talking to him, I'll catch you in a little bit. Hey, we just got a signal from Park Rat Pack. We're gonna walk over, see what he's got. He looks happy. The park that keeps giving, I'm telling you. Let's take a look and see what he's got. Hang on. Let's see his thing real quick. <laughs> see what I'm doing here. Here we go. Make sure I'm recording. Cause I'm bad about that. I'm so bad about it. I had to make sure I was recording because the videos you all don't get to see. So, <laughs> hey, we're down here with Park Rat Pat. Like I said, if I could get oh, close wow. enough over here to show you and come down here and done a quick test hit of the area we've not hunted a lot of. And I'll be daggone if he comes down and knocks out a beautiful, I think you said a 1930, 1939 Mercury Dime. So there's still some stuff here, oh, some yeah. real good stuff. Now there's a little less. <laughs> well, yeah, there is just a little less. <laughs> hey, next next good find, we'll holler right back at you and see what we can find, okay? What do you think about Park Rat Pat drives all the way up to Tennessee and pulls big mercury out of the park I put hunting in? So that's okay. Walked right over, not long after. You can see it laying there. A little old copper penny there's all kinds still down here it looks like so let's keep hunting see what else we can find hopefully i can catch him before it's over so stay with stay with me here we go well here we go 25 I had a little bouncer than what I was thinking it was 23 25 26 25 26 28 let's take a look and see what we got here let me get right back with you when I dig it up okay well sometimes there's trash for treasure so man they sound good though when they're turned up like that right there just flat detector loves them so let's keep hunting see what else we can find okay i don't get excited too much 
because you never know what's going to be here. It's a lot of trash here, but there's the signal if you can see it. A lot of 29, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 29, 29, 30. Not too deep in the ground. Everything I found good out of here is not too deep in the ground though. I mean, we're talking four inches deepest on some of the best stuff. So we're going to take a quick look at this and see what it is. Let me get right back to you. Well, didn't have to go too far. It's laying right there on top of the ground. That definitely looks like a quarter. It's a newer quarter. So, hey, at least we're putting battery money in our pockets. So... Let's keep digging, see what we can get. Hey, what's going on? Been a little bit. We ain't found too many good at signals here. But we're trying. We're giving it a heck of an effort. We've strolled up a little bit farther up. Pat's still down in there a little bit. You can hear him beep every once in a while. I know he's around in here somewhere. But we ended up 31, 31, 31, 31, 32, 30. Every now and then done what somebody suggested me to do raise coil up about six inches and sweep over it i lost it when i pulled it up off the ground so went ahead and dug it well believe it or not it's not an aluminum can it's pretty interesting little find it's a little old imp lock so we pulled a lock out so that ain't too bad we're finding some older stuff in here still still finding older stuff in here pretty interesting little finds so hey we'll get back to you if we can find something else here we go Hey, right up from that lock, we hit a 23, 23, 23, 23. Usually a penny. We've done found one wheat penny for the day, so let's see if we can pull another one. 23 is a pretty good signal, so wasn't that deep. Give me just a second, we'll dig it up and see what it is. Well, 23 signal turned out to be a screw cap. That's okay, yo. We've had a pretty good day today. Like I said, today is wedding day. My daughter's getting married. We're gonna be here for a few minutes. I don't know how much longer I'm gonna be here. Maybe about an hour. See what else we can find. I mean, it's just beautiful day, beautiful today. It's not too hot, standing right out here in the sun. I mean, I'm directly in the sun. It's somewhere in the low 70s, mid 70s. But it is also about 10.30, so it's still early in the morning. So, but we'll get back to you, see what else we can find. You never know, you might even see a young lady in a wedding dress before this video is over. I don't know. She might get a little aggravated at me. She never can tell. Now we're pulling a 21, solid 21. 21, 22. Usually it's penny. But there's a lot of screw on bottle caps down here too, so let's dig it up and see what it is. I don't know if you can see it or not, but it's laying there. Get dirt on my camera again. A little old shield penny. Newer penny. Shield on the back. That's still battery money, so here we go. That's when somebody wants to. Hey everybody, I really hate to run, but I've got to do a huge giveaway today. I am going down and giving my daughter away at the wedding. Oh, so yeah. we're gonna jump out of here real quick. Always, always a pleasure to hunt Parker at Pat. Absolutely. Pleasure, honor, honor, because he's one that's really helped me the most, got me to where I'm at. So but we'll go over a few little finds here. We'll cover this one up right quick. See, I got it covered up so you can't see it. You got the little <laughs> imp lock, little change. Ended up finding a 1950 wheat penny, which is pretty awesome. And usually what happens when you find the wheat pennies, yeah, and of course, Park Rat Pat, down at the park, 1939, if I remember right. Yes, sir. Pulls a big mercury out. Hey, awesome. This park is keep on, keep on, keep on giving to us. So we're always blessed just to get out and see each other be able to hunt together and just enjoy the day like i said i'm heading down to the wedding getting ready to get cleaned up i might shoot a clip or two there i don't know i'll be dressed up down there you might not recognize me you never can tell it's hard to tell but uh, always again thanks to mr pat for coming up and hunting with me and until thanks for having me oh, man. Not, not a problem you know what gets me is i've been coming here for years visiting family right here in kingsport we could have met years ago and never even known it. <laughs> and that's why that's part of life right there. You never know what what's gonna be thrown your way. 
But hey, we're gonna get out of here. Hey, until next dig, hey, y'all be safe out there, okay? Peace. Hey, Pat, you've been such a great help to Whistle Pig Digging, man. I really appreciate it. So, man, I'm gonna give this one out. Big shout out to you on this one. Hope you enjoy this. Ready? Yep. Put the camera one, two, three. You're only one hole away from a really great day.